Hey boys, welcome back to some Kalen Ponga career, and we did finish the season, having a look at the Delhi M's, and we did finish on top, uh, unsurprisingly, we killed it, uh, 47, uh, yeah, bit of a no-brainer right there, as I was trying to scroll across and, uh, look at the, um, I was trying to find, like, the, the winner of the comp, or, the, like, the, the fixtures, I don't, I always find it annoying sort of the menus in this trying to find like the the uh, correct competition and stuff but the sharks do end up winning uh they did beat us in the last round of the comp and were the minor premiers so we are going to be uh taking on or we're, we're going to be playing in the world cup um aspect here as we are going to spend our money on the place kick which uh, hopefully we will eventually get to kick goals but uh, we'll see, dude. But, um, yeah, taking on Samoa in, uh, the equivalent of, uh, the World Cup here. So, it should be, it should be good. Obviously, playing for New Zealand. Um, <laughs> you know, one of those little things, uh, you know. I talked about it before, because we did play a one-off test match for New Zealand, and then we played, uh, State of Origin for Queensland. Um, but, you know, I'm, I'm fine with that. I don't, <laughs> it's actually pretty cool that we get to play for New Zealand, and then also play uh for Queensland so looking at our team look pretty good there's always a couple of weird ones but uh it should be a strong forward pack that's for sure uh Greg Eastwood still around um and then the bench pretty good bench I mean we've got an x-factor in Cody Nicarima coming on the bench and yeah the, the Samoan side I didn't actually look to see who they picked usually usually the AI can have a few strange ones but they do have Mason Lino in the halves who was a good young player and, uh, yeah, it should be a tough game. I'm not going to lie. Hopefully we can, hopefully we can perform pretty well in this, uh, competition. We, we, you know, personally, we had a good season. Uh, didn't finish where we'd like is we get a, a break straight away. Some flimsy Samoan defense there early in the piece as, uh, they get it out to Antonio Winterstein. <laughs> He's just going to cut back and streak away here and score under the post. That was awful defense. I actually remember this because I, I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> I think I was like looking at my phone or something, um, looking at something and, uh, and they made a clean line break and I, I was just, I wasn't in position. So, yeah, early try to to the Samoans here, which, uh, you know, you would expect them, they, they would obviously fire up early. I, I guess we're going to look to come home strong is the kick. It was a booming kick, but it's gone out on the full. I, I thought I, I hit it sweetly, just it would have been a 40-20, just a little too much on it. Um, yeah, that was unfortunate. It's big Sam Cassiano driving towards the line. No one's helping us. Kalen Ponga versus Cassiano, a mismatch of all time right there. And the big fella is just going to score the second try of the game and second try to Samoa. All of a sudden, 12-0. It's not looking too good. <laughs> it's not looking good at all. Um, yeah, I mean, uh, the second try was definitely our fault for kicking it out on the full. It's not a bad... Um, you know, tactic, you know, it was a good, well, I can't say it was a good kick, it was, it was almost a good kick, it was almost a beautiful kick, but it didn't happen like that, is, uh, it was that Proctor, I think, trying to put in the little kick, I did call for the grabber, but he just didn't get his foot to the ball quick enough, resulting in a knock-on, so this first half has been an absolute shambles, you know, uh, which, I mean, you shouldn't expect it, as we are going to throw Ricky Latelli out of field there. That's a, it's a good bit of defensive work that time, getting across and covering. But, uh, you know, new new squad, uh, taking a bit to, to warm into this game, obviously. As uh, off the scrum here, getting around, obviously, Milford there, trying to catch us. He's going to try the bigger lunging dive, but we're going to streak away and score the first try of this World Cup for New Zealand, our first try in the World Cup, and uh, that's a that's a big that's a big moment. Uh, Anthony Milford, I thought he was going to have the legs on us, honestly, but uh, thankfully we were able to skip out of the attempted ankle tap and twelve six now, which you know we'd be pretty happy with going in six points down the uh, the first half we've had. You know, terrible like I, like I've said terrible first half of football for us but you know we we've hit back and hopefully get a little bit of confidence going in I mean we got a chance to actually post some more points here 
couple of minutes left, a couple of plays left, and a uh, chance to put in an attacking kick. We're actually going to take it. Trying to put in a kick in behind. Uh, Sean Johnson was actually on our shoulder. Thought it was going to work out pretty well, but uh, just a little too late to, to release and cop the cop the big hit for our troubles as that should be the last play of the first half there we have it so 12-6 um to Samoa they're obviously coming out of the blocks firing uh we we started to get a little bit of momentum get a little bit of confidence uh going into the break so hopefully we can come out and uh right there good defense Nofaluma this time gets thrown into thrown into touch by I think Zelezniak on the wing there so uh, fairly reminiscent. Hopefully, we can uh, potentially score another try for scrum. I wouldn't mind that at all, as uh, we get it off the uh, off the scrum. That's just sort of that's sort of the play we do every time we play, like for our Broncos career mode as well. The the decoy goes through, and Kieran Four in that time, bursting into the backfield. So, yeah, not not a bad start, but uh, a bit over 20 minutes left. Still, that six point lead is Anthony Milford there. It is going to be intercepted. That's a big moment. They they had us on the back foot. Milford went straight through. There was a, a massive hole there. And thankfully, we we came across for the covering. They got the pass away. Just uh, probably one too many passes. Um, as uh, Zelezniak down the sideline gets it back to us. We're putting the foot down. And it was our chasing, not for Luma. I thought he was going to get to us. It was a massive chase, but we're going to score our second try, bring us back within two points, and right here, it's going to be a, it's going to be a big kick, unfortunately, we don't have the kick, it's going to be Bryson Goodwin, who's in the team, um, I don't know why Sean Johnson's kicking stat isn't higher in the game, it's, it's very strange, as he's going to line it, it should be a pretty simple conversion, and he doesn't make a mistake, so 12 apiece, uh, yeah, that was, that was a big, a big play, you know, the pressure was on against Samoa, they're, they're a good team, uh, for sure, but New Zealand here, we should be, uh, the better team as we do a little chip and chase, get the offload away, so we're starting to, we're starting to get into our rhythm here, we're looking pretty, uh, pretty good, honestly, and we're gonna slot back here, Johnson takes it up, gets it back to us, and we slot the field goal pretty early, but, I mean, you know, there was no real pressure, so it was a good chance to take the one-pointer, get the lead, and yeah, I mean, it's, it's 13 points back-to-back uh, -back here, so yeah, we're, we're on a bit of a roll, and we're starting to we're starting to play some pretty good footy as a little kick downfield. Wanted a little bit more distance, but again, you know, kicking it into the corner, just sort of putting the pressure on with our defense, and it's it's been a good turnaround, honestly, but that's a good ball back to... Isaac Luke, I thought he was going to hit the hole, but not to be his last tackle here. A couple of minutes remaining, probably could seal the game with a repeat set or a try, obviously, but you're going to put a bit of a shock and kick in. It almost works out. It's almost going to be a try to Alex Glenn, I think it is, the back roller, but turning the ball over a couple of meters out from the trial line, it should be game set and match from this point. Junior Paulo takes the hit up there, so they're going to have to do something pretty special here. Give it to uh, to Milford, that's who they do give it to, but uh, Cassiano is going to take the tackle, and uh, a come from behind victory, it was a sloppy first half, but I mean, we showed a bit of class there to come out with the win, so hopefully guys are going to enjoy the, the sort of mini-series here with Caelan Ponga, and I'll see you in the next one.